So we're able to see some key pieces of evidence and News 18's Madison Cop has the details about what happened today in the courtroom. It's day four of the Delphi double homicide trial for suspect Richard Allen. Allen is accused of kidnapping and murdering Abby Williams and Liberty German near a hiking trail in Delphi in 2017. Trial began this morning with the state continuing their examination of Brian O'Leahy. O'Leahy is a retired ISP CSI and was in charge of documenting the scene and preserving evidence. The persecution set up a table in front of the courtroom with brown evidence bags from the items found at Deer Creek and at the scene, or what the police call ground zero. Over 45 pieces of evidence collected by O'Leahy and other CSIs were presented today, and three of those were passed around to the jury. Items found at Deer Creek included a Nike shoe, jeans, a tie-dye shirt, socks, and pink undergarments. Items found at the scene included a Nike shoe found under Abby's body, a 40 caliber unfired bullet, strands from both girls, a phone, and many swabs. An important topic of discussion from the state was the handling of evidence from the scene. Olehi made it known that no items were packaged together and all items were taken to temporary storage. A sexual assault kit was also done on both girls. After an hour of questionings from the prosecution, cross-examination began from the defense. The defense asked questions about Allen's connection to the scene, if the scene could have been compromised, and if there were any defense wounds on Libby, all of which Olehi denied. We will keep you updated with the latest from inside the courtroom. Until then, reporting in Delphi, Madison Cobb.